Good evening. Can you hold your mouthpiece again? The mouthpiece. In your headset. Put in near your mouth. There, okay. Can you try speaking? Hello. Better. It's louder, okay? So, how was your weekend? How did you spend your weekend? Where did you go? I go to the beach. You go to, you went to the beach? Yes. Who's with you? My family. Your family. So, when was it? Saturday or Sunday? Saturday. Saturday. Did you enjoy? Yes. Okay. So, are you ready for our lesson tonight? Yes. Okay, we will be continuing our lesson from where we stopped last time, okay? Yes. Okay, last time, we studied about Have, had, has. Okay. So now can you complete the sentence? With have. Just has a bag. Okay, and Jack have a bat. Okay, so what is Jack holding here in his arm? Do you know what is this? It's a shower. It's a soap. Okay. This one is a soap. And how about this one? What is this? What do you call this one? I can see the mouth. This one, what is this? It's a shower. Okay, Cham, so let's go to the next slide. Okay, we will be studying the base form, past simple, past participle, and meaning, okay? Okay, so for the first one, can you read the base form? What is the base form? I cannot see. You cannot see. Wait, I'll stop sharing and then share it again with you. Can you see it now? Yes. Okay, kindly read the base form. Green. Okay, past simple. Okay, say it. One more time, three times. Brought. 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 Okay, past participle. Kindly read it three times. Brought. 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 Okay. And for the meaning... What does it mean? What can you say about the picture? What can you say about the picture? Can you tell me what do you see in the picture here? I cannot hear you, Cham. I cannot hear you. Um, a man. Okay, a man. Uh, 
I don't know what. Okay, I say the man brings his food, food bike. This is where he sells food. So he brings it with him, okay? Okay, okay and the base form, this one. Kindly read, Cham. Bring. The second one, this one. Can you see the second one? It's buy. Buy. Bought. Bought. And for past participle, bought. Can you read it, Cham? I can't see. You cannot see? Wait, why is it that you cannot see it? Can you see it now? Yes. Okay, so what is the meaning? What do you think is the guy in the picture doing? And going to buy something. Yes, he is going to buy something. So, it's buy. How about catch? Can you read catch? Uh, I cannot see. You cannot see? Why is it that you cannot see? What's the problem? Can you see it now, Cham? Yes. Okay, so kindly read caught. 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 Okay, and for the meaning. Okay. What do you think is the meaning of the word catch? Um. He cut. Yes, he gets the ball using his hand. So if something is thrown to you, you catch it, okay? It's catch, okay? okay? And the next word is fight. Say fight. Can you say it? Fight. No, I can't see. You cannot see it again? Yeah. Anything? Now, can you see something? Uh, no. Nothing. Why? Wait. I'll just close the PowerPoint, okay? Okay. Okay, so now can you see it, Cham? Can you see it now? No. Can you see it? No. No? Anything? You cannot see anything? I can see brain. Okay, that's good. Okay, so now we are in fight. Can you say fight? Fight. Fought. 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 Okay, look at the picture. What can you say? Fight. 
fight. Okay. Sam, is it good to fight with other kids? No. Have you ever fought with someone? No. Even with your friends? No. Wow, such a good kid. Okay. So teach. Can you teach? Read? Okay, and past simple taught. Taught. Past participle taught. Taught. Okay, okay. So can you tell me what can you see in the picture? I can see picture. Okay, what is the teacher doing? I cannot see. You cannot see? What's the problem? Can you see the picture? No. But can you see teach? Yes. Now, can you see? Yes. Okay. So can you tell me what do you see in this picture? Uh, a teacher is teaching teach. teach. Okay, teaching kids. Okay, so let's read thing. Think. Think. Thought. 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 Okay. So when you are thinking, what are you using? What part of your body are you using when you are thinking? Can you speak? Again, uh, Cham, when you are thinking, what part of your head, what part of the head are you using? When you are thinking, I don't know. It's the brain. Can you read it, Cham? The black, black. brain. Brain. We, we use the brain the for brain thinking. For thinking. Okay, great. So let's go to the next one. Group two. Past simple, past participle, base form, and meaning. Okay, so let's read first. Wait. Okay, so let's try the first one. Begin. Begin. Past simple, began. Began. Past participle, begun. Begun. Okay, meaning. It means to start, okay? Begin okay. is to start. Okay, so for the next one, base form, drink. Drink. Past simple, drank. Drank. Past participle, drunk. Drunk. You use past participle with the, with the verb have. Okay, have, had, began, has. Okay, with have, had, and has, okay? What is the girl in the picture doing? He, uh, he drinking, drink a water. Okay, you said he, he drinking. She. Oh, oh yes, you are correct. It should be she. She is drinking a water okay and for the next one our base form is ring 
Ring. A simple wrong. Wrong. Past participle wrong. Wrong. Okay. So what other gadget rings aside from a telephone? Can you give me it something that you use for calling right now? It also rings. It starts with letter C. Telephone. Telephone, it starts with letter C. It's small. Cell phone. Right? It also rings a cell phone, okay? So, let's read. Run. 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 What is the bear doing? Uh, the bear is run. Okay, you said the bear is run. It should be the bear is running. Can you say it? The bear is running. Okay, so let's say sing. Sing. Sang. 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 Okay, so what do you call these kids? Group of kids that are singing or group of persons that are singing together, what do you call it? Yes, what do you call a group of persons singing together? What do you call them? Do you know, Cham? Okay, I will type down at the chat box. Can you read that, Cham? You call a group of person singing together a choir. Choir. Okay. So you use the past simple as the past ten. Okay. While with past participle, you use it have had or has plus past participle of the verb okay can you read it Past simple as the past tense. Past simple. Past simple as the past tense. Okay, and past participle, you use it, have had or has plus past participle of the verb. Okay, like for example, had begun, has begun, have begun, have drank, had drank, has. Okay, run, have, have run, had run, has run, have had, has. Uh, you use has for singular noun. Have for plural noun. Had for the past, okay? So let's see. 
let's go to the next group. Group three. Okay. Draw. Draw. Drew. Drew. Drawn. Drawn. Okay, can you see the picture? I cannot see picture. Okay, so I will show you everything. Maybe it's because I haven't shown you everything. Okay? Okay, so let's read. Can you say, can you tell me what do you see in the picture? Uh, 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 draw, drawing. Yes, a drawing. What is this drawing? Do you know what is this? A castle. Okay, a castle. So let's read the next, the next word. Say fly. Fly. Flew. Flew. Flow. Flow. These words are past participle, okay? Remember it. And this one is past simple. These are the past tense of the verb, okay? Grow. Grow. Grew. Grew. Grow. Grow. No. No. New. New. No. No. Throw. 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 Through. 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 Throw. Throw. Sound the TH sound, darling. Throw. 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 Sound the TH. Throw. 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 Throne. Okay. Okay, we will read and underline the past simple or the present perfect. First, I will be the reporter and you are my, okay? Have you ever done volunteer work? Yes, I'm a member of Be A Buddy, a program that has three children. Last year, we provide even the class provided invited say it Even again Pro oh wait wait chum say it again provided Pro 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 one more time provided provided okay continue evening class classes classes for 50 children. Wonderful. What else have you done? We ask people to donate book and clothes to the children. Okay, say this one again. Ask. Ask. One more time. Ask. Ask. One more time, darling. Ask. Ask. Very good. And books. Books. Okay, now we change roles. You will be the reporter and I am my. Have you ever done volunteer? Volunteer. Volunteer work. Yes, I'm a member of a body, a program that helps street children. Last year, we provided evening classes for 50 children. Wonderful. What else have you done? We've asked people to donate books and clothes to the children. Okay, so what you are going to do is read the past simple. The verbs that has ed and the present perfect using have, has, or had, okay? Draw a line. I will share to you the remote.
I already shared to you the remote control. Cham. Do you have a mouse there? A mouse? Yeah. Underline. Under. Under. Do you have like this? Um, no. Oh, okay. So can you just tell me which one is a present perfect? Um, provided. Is that a present perfect or a past simple? Uh, past simple. Okay, so past simple. Um, what else? Ask. 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 Okay, what else? We've asked. Um, this is a contraction. This is a have. This is have. This one, it's a contraction. But this one, we have asked. If we are going to make it long, it's we have asked. Okay, so it's a contraction. It's a present perfect. What else? Present. Uh. Okay, so let's check if you answered correctly. Okay, this one. Have you ever done volunteer work? It's also a present perfect. Cham, can you read it? I, I cannot see. You cannot see again. Wait. Can you see it now? Mm, yes. Okay, so this one is a present perfect. Can you read it? Have you ever done volunteer work? Have you ever done volunteer work? Okay, and provided evening class for 50 children. Pro provide. Provided. Provided. Every evening classes for 50 children okay and have you done what else have you done it's a present perfect okay and the last one we've asked people to donate books and clothes to children okay cham when you say volunteer work what does it mean uh, i don't know okay when we say when we say volunteer it means uh free or for helping other people for free okay that's what volunteer work means helping other people for free helping other people for free okay when we say donate what does it mean? Um, when you say you donated books and clothes to children, what does it mean? Uh, I don't know how to say that. Okay, so teacher will help you, okay? No problem. When we say we donate books, it means we give. Books and clothes. Can you say it? Give book and clothes. That is what donate means. We give away to other yeah. kids that will that will be needing them. Okay. Okay. Have you ever done donating books and clothes to other children? Sharing. Yes. Yeah. Share. Yes. 
So when do you gave your books and clothes away? Do you still remember when you when you donated the books and clothes to the children? I don't remember. But you have, but you have donated books and clothes to other children. Yeah. Do you think donating books and clothes to other children is a nice thing to do? Yes. So do you like donating books and clothes to other children? Yes. Okay. Okay, give the correct form of the verb in the bracket. The past the past tense. Can you type it down? You can type it down. I will share to you the remote. Type here. Type the past the past tense. Past tense, darling. Past tense is ending with D or ED. Okay. How about for this one? What are you going to use? Was or are? Or am? I, what is the past tense of B? Is it am? Um? Um. I don't know. Okay, we will check later. Okay, how about for this one? What's your answer? So you can read the sentence. Okay, later we will check your answer. How about for this one? How about for this one? For number four, Okay. 
Check your spelling, Cham. Okay, and let's, how about this one? The phone suddenly rang wrong. What should it be? Rang or wrong? Is it R-A-N-G or R-U-N-G? Okay, so let's check the answers. Okay, the correct form of the verb should be my mom has lived with the with the verb has because mom is singular. I was because the past tense of be is was. We have just taken because the past participle of take is taken. Okay, darling? Remember, we use have plus past participle, which is taken. I had. Had because I is singular and it happens in the past. It happens in the past. That's why it should be had. Okay? They haven't lived so far. Mr. Dam had organized. Okay, you are correct. And for number five, you are correct. So I will check your correct answer. So your correct answer is five. So your correct answer, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So your score is only two over seven. So I will review how to use it, okay? Okay. Has plus the past tense of the verb with D, okay? Has is used. Has is used for singular subject. Has plus. Has plus past tense of the. Verb. It should be with D or E D. Okay, darling. Okay. Okay, and have we use it? Have plus have have plus pass participle. Okay, uh, Cham, I will ask you, what is the base form of taken? The base form of the verb. The basic form of taken. Take. Take, okay. How about the past tense? Uh, take. Took. Talk. Okay, so take, took, and the past participle is taken. Take. Oh. Okay, so have plus past participle. While this one had, we use this for the past 
past that, past, okay? This one, they haven't lived. Have because they is a plural subject, okay? So we use have plus the past simple, which is live with D, okay? Okay. Is it clear now? Um. Is it clear or... So, okay, so let me ask you. When do we use has? For singular subject or plural subject? Singular. Okay. How about have? Singular or plural? Plural. Okay, when do we use have with past participle or past simple? Past simple. Is it past simple? How about, look, taken, what is this? Have plus past participle. Okay, darling? Okay. Okay, so remember that. So more than 10 years so far, yesterday morning, last week, subject plus verb plus ing plus subject plus verb. Conditional sentence type 3, okay? Okay, tell me. What is your answer? Repeat. Uh, read the sent the whole sentence first. Has because Ming has a go work for a charity shop. He really wants to do it okay uh try again for number one because we have take has ever worked A charity self. He already want to do it. Okay, so your answer is ever. We will check later if you are correct, okay? Okay. How about for number two? Uh, last week, we visited Sick children in Vietnam hospital. Okay, and number three. Dung Dung has many time finish the homework. Okay, number four. Have you read that book ever? Okay, and number five. I cannot see number five. You cannot see number five. Can you see it now? Uh, no. Okay, so let's just check the answer for number one to four. Okay, so for number one, it's never. Number two, last week. Number four, already. And number four, yet. Okay, so you only have one correct answer. Wow. Can you... 
<laughs> it's okay. Can you read the sentence again? The correct sentence with the answer, Sam? Because May has never worked for a charity, so he really want to do is. Last week, we visited sick children in Vedic Hospital. Nhung has already finished all the homework. Have you read that book yet? Okay, so Cham, we have no time for this lesson. Our time has ended, so I'm so sorry for that. So I just want you to review the usage of have, had, or has, okay, if you have time. Review it, check on the internet, okay? Okay. Okay, so have a great evening, Cham. Bye-bye.